Five hours later. Merry Christmas and happy holidays to everybody. It has been a while. Uh, but I have a package in front of me that I've been waiting to open up. And I think now is a pretty good time. I wanted to share this package with everybody. Uh, as far as opening it. Uh, let's see if I could... Yeah, let me just cut that open here. Try not to cut my finger. Fear. Fears, because I am clumsy as hell. And so, as many of you know, I do collect Marvel Legend figures, and I'm a big X-Men fan. So, I wanted to finally... I wanted to... I don't, th I don't know if I've completed it, but I am trying to complete, and the keyword is trying to, attempting to, complete my X-Men Blue Team and my X-Men Gold Team, and so I finally picked up a Jean Grey, a Hasbro Jean Grey at that. Love. And I don't think this is the Love Triangle Jean Grey. I think this is the 2013 version. But I picked this up from a seller on eBay. And the description said, display, used for displays only. This is packaged really nicely. Um, heads up. To, or shout out, not heads up, but shout out to whoever packages because this is packaged beautifully. And speaking of beautiful, let's, oh my! Let's check out this Jean Grey. Oh no! Oh! All right, all right. So, first thing that I notice is the blue is pretty... It, it stands out. It stands out really well. And I was going to say overwhelming, but I don't know if that's overwhelming. But it does stand out. And one of the things that I try to do is used figures is if the joints are loose and you shake the figure, um, you don't want the legs like, f you know, like flapping around. Um, it seems like the joints are pretty, they're, uh, they're still in good shape. So that's a good sign. Um, it's a very good sign. So let's let's uh, let's go through it, right? So looks like you got the uh, the ratchet shoulders, which I do. Let's see, you got the not double jointed, but it's like a swivel joint on the elbows. Got the uh, got a little swivel on on the wrist, which is good. Same thing with both sides, and you could get to like a good ninety degree angle. Let's see if she could. She's very um. When they're trying to convey her telepathic and telekinetic powers, uh, she uses a lot of hand gestures. So it's important for um, it's important for 
this figure to have good manipulation of the hands and um, and arms just uh, so you could convey those motions with the figure if you want to display it as such yeah you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and say that that blue is pretty overwhelming um, I would have liked for them to use a matte blue um, but then again I didn't get the I didn't get the love triangle Jean Grey I think this is the 2013 Jean Grey uh, when Hasbro was just starting to make uh, better figures and um, they were just starting to make better female figures uh, and then you know now they've just perfected you know like all the their sculpts and molds but yeah double jointed knees and it, they're still in really good condition I thought when I took it out of the packaging the knees were like you know you're flapping around but that's not the case um, is it a ratchet no it's not a ratchet knee they're both double jointed though which is good you got a swivel in like the top uh, the upper thigh you got those those cargo pants <laughs> um, and then you know like the 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 super weird 90s like thong like blue like the implied thong <laughs> the yellow is the outfit that's not her skin um if you didn't live in that era but like you know jim lee made some really cool like designs and it's lasted for such a long time um yeah the hair is you know, it, it looks like it's not going to get in the way of me trying to make um, poses with this figure. Uh, I don't think I'm going to make any dynamic poses, uh, just to be honest with you all. Uh, I think I'm just going to, you know, I'm going to add this to my X-Men uh, display. Um, if you go back in my videos, I have a huge display. Of like my Marvel Legends and um, what else do I have there? My Star Wars Black Series. It's all in like one spot. Um, unfortunately, I don't have more areas to to display them. But it has been a while since I made a video, and um, yeah, I think uh, adding this to my collection is. Uh, a big plus I, I like the facial expression on her face it's like blank <laughs> it's just that is as blank of a stare that you'll ever get from a person ever like literally if someone makes this facial expression towards you you probably just said some dumb shit it's like <laughs> is seriously like this facial expression is like oh you're not shit <laughs> you ain't shit and uh you just said something dumb yeah either that or she's just very she's just concentrating and she instead of looking at you she's looking through you which i don't know is even better i think that's probably worse than looking at you and thinking you're dumb um yeah it just ah oh man um yeah I don't know I think you know for me I'm pretty biased because like I've been wanting a Jean Grey figure in my collection for a while so I mean I could I think the hair honestly is like that's more drastic than I would like I, I'm I'm down for like the the 90s you know like a cartoon ponytail um but this is cool this is cool I mean you know like a Jean Grey in my collection that I've been waited for, for for like what like five years maybe more since I was a kid actually this is the Jean, first Jean Grey I've ever had in my collection ever ever I've had a Psylocke I've had multiple Psylocke's 
in my collection. Like at least three Psylocke's in my collection. Never a Jean Grey. This is the first one. Um, so I'm just going to end with that and say, yeah, this is, uh, I've added a Jean Grey to my collection. Um, it's been a while since I made a video, but I'm glad I made a video for this one. Uh, thanks for sitting through me talking about how much I like this figure. Um, hope you all have a safe New Year's. Take care, everybody. Stay safe. Wear your mask. Take care.